Hi, I'm Chef Floyd Cardos, and I'm at the North End Grill in Manhattan. And, and today we're going to braise some short ribs, and I'm going to be cooking them in a pressure cooker. What I'm going to do is I'm going to season them with salt, and let it sit for a couple of minutes. And then we're going to salt and pepper. You want to let this sit for about four to five minutes. Then I'm going to add a little bit of canola oil. I have my, my pan preheating. And I'm going to take my short ribs and I'm going to sear them on all sides. I'm going to be searing the short ribs for between 8 to 12 minutes. So now we're going to take our short ribs off. And in the same pan, we're going to add our onions, garlic, carrots, celery, leeks, ginger, and bay leaf. And we're going to cook this for six to eight minutes. So our vegetables look good. And now we're going to add the rest of our ingredients. So we have our spice mix, which is uh, clove, cinnamon, a little bit of turmeric, paprika. And we're going to cook this for about one to two minutes. So it cooks out a little bit. So while this is cooking, we're gonna add our tomatoes, chicken stock, red wine, we're gonna add the tamarind next, brown sugar, and salt. And lastly, a little bit of red wine vinegar. Once all the ingredients are in there, we're gonna bring it up to a boil. We're gonna add the short ribs back in again. We're gonna put the lid on and we're gonna bring it up to pressure so it cooks for about 20 to 30 minutes. This has been cooking for about 25 to 30 minutes, and we're gonna check and see if they're done. Oh boy, that's beautiful. Then you wanna make sure that your braise is nice and soft so your fork goes in, comes right out. So I love cooking my short ribs a day before and keeping it for the next day. I find when they sit in the fridge for a day, it brings a lot more of the flavor out. And then if you have leftovers, I make sandwiches, I make tacos. It's a great way to make a meal extend itself. And here are your braised short ribs. Hi, I'm Chef Floyd Cardos, and I'm at the North End Grill in Manhattan. And, and today we